positive half cycle generator this positive half cycle generator consists of one transformer one diode and one resistor here we have to give ac input and the rectified output or positive cycle is obtained at the output that is resistor r here we apply the ac input based on this circuit diagram here we have constructed a circuit this circuit a diode that is 1 in 4007 and a resistor that is carbon resistor its value is 1 kilo as per circuit diagram connected a diode the diode which is having silver ring it is cathode and this is anode one point of transformer this is transformer it is having three terminals this is center tap transformer 12 0 12 we have to connect the input of this circuit one wire is connected to diode and wire is connected to ground or i can say to the resistor once we apply the input at this resistor we obtain the output let's observe the input this this is a cro it is one and channel 2 channel 1 here we have to set as ac it is b connector polarity one is positive and one another is negative we should connect this negative always to the ground i will connect here to the ground let's check the input with the help of this positive connector i will check the input connect this input at the output of the transformer here we can observe that here we can observe that this is the input of a circuit or output of a transformer let's measure its value first we will measure the amplitude we will set this amplitude as per our convenience here we can see that the channel 1 is having volts per division we have to count the number of divisions here then we should multiply this value with this volts per division i will set it properly let's measure it it is having total 1 2 3 4 5 and 5.4 units we will multiply this with this 5 volt that turns out to be just 5 into 2. Point, uh, 5 into we will we'll calculate this with the help of calculator. Total the height is 5.4 unit. We will multiply this 5.4 into 5. That turns out to be 5.4 into 5. That will be 27 volt peak to peak. And now we will measure the frequency. In order to measure frequency, we have to that is one positive. and one negative we will set this to ground to set reference value and turn it to ac using x position adjust it properly now we will measure its width here from 0 1 2 3 and 3.5 we have to keep this calibration button to maximum we'll measure it once again one 2 3 4 4 into 5 4 into 5 millisecond total 0.02 second if i total second that is 50 hertz in the input we are getting 25 volt and 50 hertz now let's check the output value in order to observe the output we have to connect this the another end of the diode here we can see that in cro here we obtain the rectified output or the only positive half cycle let's measure its value first we'll measure the amplitude we have to measure the amplitude from this end that is 1 to 2.6 2.6 into we have to multiply this value in 
into 5 that is total 13 volt is output and the frequency is we have to measure this positive half cycle as well as this blank line that is 1 2 3 4 4 into 5 millisecond 4 into 5 millisecond that is again 0 0.02 second if I make 1 divided by this value that is again 50 hertz the same value we have noted here in the tabular column 